Why Earth is sinking near Arctic region? Why is the Earth sinking near the Arctic? And what's causing this mysterious phenomena? Join us on a chilling journey through Siberian sinkholes and Alaskan methane leaks. Discover the surprising link to melting permafrost, where a horrifying secret is unveiled, trapped methane gas. But why is it escaping, crafting explosive craters? In simple terms, why is Earth signaling distress? And how does climate change factor in this sinking mystery? The answers expose a startling truth about our planet's delicate balance. Could this be Earth's silent cry for help? Before we dive deep, remember to like, share, and subscribe for more intriguing revelations. Now, let's unravel why Earth appears to be silently pleading for assistance near the Arctic, an environmental awakening demanding our attention. Let's explore these chilling answers together. In the frosty expanse of Siberia's Yamal Peninsula, a helicopter pilot's routine flight in 2014 turned into an extraordinary discovery. A colossal hole, unlike any sinkhole ever seen, sprawled beneath 80 feet wide and as deep as a 15-story building. This wasn't just another oddity. It was a spectacle that captivated the world's attention once the pilot shared the photos online. Scientific minds globally were left scratching their heads. Geologists, Arctic researchers, and experts were in uncharted territory. Sinkholes are usually the result of water weakening the ground. But this one was different. It resembled a massive crater, with debris scattered up to 900 meters away. It didn't fit the typical mold, and the mystery deepened. The initial suspects, like asteroids and volcanic activity, were ruled out. Then unexpected clue emerged methane gas. The kind of gas we use for cooking turned out to be the key player in this geological enigma. Too much methane underground, mixed with air, could cause a fiery explosion. It seemed like these explosive sinkholes were Earth's way of reminding us of its hidden surprises. But the plot thickened. The Yama Peninsula became a hotspot for these bizarre sinkholes, popping up one after another since 2014. Satellite images revealed a troubling trend, and scientists began to connect the dots with climate change. So what does climate change have to do with these explosive craters? Turns out, quite a bit. The Earth is heating up, and one consequence is the melting of permafrost, frozen ground that's been locked in a deep chill for a long, long time. As this permafrost thaws, it releases trapped methane gas into the atmosphere. When this methane accumulates underground and then meets the air, kaboom, we get sinkholes. It's like a climate change alarm bell, ringing loud and clear beneath our feet. These sinkholes aren't just geological oddities. They're tangible signs that our actions are reshaping the very ground we stand on. In simple terms, picture Earth as a giant, dynamic puzzle. Climate change is throwing in unexpected pieces, and these explosive sinkholes are like the puzzle pieces snapping into place with a bang. They're a vivid illustration of the Earth responding to the changes we're causing. These explosive craters are Earth's way of saying, hey, wake up. The way you're treating me is literally reshaping the landscape. It's a dramatic reminder that the impact of our actions extends far beyond what we see on the surface. It's happening right beneath our feet in the heart of the planet. The Yamo Peninsula sinkholes are not just a scientific mystery. They're a wake-up call echoing through the Earth itself. Siberian sinkholes and Alaskan methane leaks linked to melting permafrost. In the aftermath of the Yamo sinkhole revelation, scientists found themselves grappling with a new question. How did this bizarre phenomenon relate to climate change? As they delved deeper, another piece of the puzzle emerged, and this time, it took them far from Siberia. The Arctic Circle, a region experiencing double the pressure of rising temperatures compared to the global average since the 19th century, became a focal point. The connection between the sinkholes and this temperature surge sparked curiosity among scientists. Could understanding each sinkhole individually unlock the broader mystery? Meanwhile, on the opposite side of the world, near Alaska's northwest coast, a team of scientists caught wind of something peculiar happening around Easy Lake. Locals had noticed bubbles rising from the lake, making it seem like the water was boiling. Intrigued, the scientists set out to investigate. To their surprise, the bubbles turned out to be methane gas, a common sight in the Arctic region, but the scale of the release was unprecedented. Easy Lake was belching out a whopping 10 tons of methane every day, a phenomenon never observed before in the Arctic Circle. The researchers decided to dive deeper, quite literally. Creating a 3D model of the lake bed with advanced scanning techniques, they discovered that the bubbles were emanating from a depth of 50 feet. Divers couldn't explore this deep, but the connection was clear. 
Methane gas leaking from the bottom of Easy Lake resembled the process suspected in the formation of the Yamal sinkholes. Both locations, Yamal and Easy Lake, shared a common factor, permafrost. These areas are situated on land where permafrost, frozen ground, is a defining feature. It seemed that the thawing permafrost was playing a crucial role in the release of methane gas, potentially causing both the explosive sinkholes in Siberia and the extraordinary methane bubbling in Easy Lake. In simpler terms, it's like a pattern emerging from the melting ice. Climate change is thawing the frozen ground, releasing trapped methane, and causing unexpected events like explosive sinkholes and massive methane leaks. The Earth, in its own way, is signaling the profound impact of climate change on its delicate balance. So as scientists connect the dots between Siberia and Isai Lake, the story unfolds. A tale of melting ice, rising temperatures, and the unforeseen consequences echoing through the Earth's dynamic landscapes. Melting permafrost, methane leaks, and the tale of explosive sinkholes. Permafrost, a frozen land found across vast areas, spanning Russia, Canada, and Alaska, hides more than meets the eye. Evidence of this frozen ground extends to places like Fox Tun in Alaska, 600 km away from McGee Lake. Even the forests above permafrost in areas like Fox Tun are showing signs of change. Locals notice trees stopping abruptly on one side, indicating weakened roots. Upon closer inspection, a sunken land with a mysterious hole and continuous water sounds emerges, a phenomenon not witnessed for centuries, but suddenly noticeable since 2018. The plot thickens as we venture into the frozen world. Beneath SCA Lake near Alaska's northwest coast, bubbles rising from the lake turn out to be methane gas, not an uncommon sight in the Arctic region. But the sheer volume, 10 tons daily, raises eyebrows. Scanning the lake bed reveals a connection to Yamal, permafrost, the frozen ground. Now, let's dig deeper, literally. A tunnel inside the permafrost in Jesus, in Fairbanks, Alaska, reveals a frozen world. Animal threads frozen for thousands of years, mammoth remains, and ancient gases, a treasure trove embedded in the frozen earth. This signifies a substantial presence of organic matter inside permafrost, which includes carbon a key player in the climate change game. Organic matter, like plants and animals, absorbs carbon dioxide during their lives. When they die, some of the carbon is released back into the atmosphere during decomposition. However, in the frigid temperatures of the Arctic Circle, the decomposition process is sluggish over centuries. This has led to the preservation of vast amounts of organic matter within permafrost. As global temperatures rise, causing permafrost to melt, the preserved organic matter, fossils, begins to decompose. Bacteria, hungry for energy, consume the carbon and release methane gas. The softening ground allows this trapped gas to escape without hindrance, creating the explosive sinkholes observed in places like Yama. In essence, the increasing number of sinkholes in the Arctic Circle is a direct consequence of the melting permafrost, unleashing trapped methane gas. The Earth, in its gradual response to climate change, is revealing the hidden impacts buried beneath the frozen surface. This tale of melting ice, rising temperatures, and unexpected repercussions emphasizes the delicate balance that climate change is disrupting across Earth's dynamic landscapes. As we unravel the chilling mysteries beneath our feet, it's hard not to feel a pang of sorrow for the toll we've taken on our planet. The Arctic sinking tale echoes a larger narrative of climate upheaval. The future hangs in the balance, and we're at the crossroads of change. Can we make Earth a green haven once more? It's a journey we must embark on together, reimagining a world where nature thrives. Let's sow the seeds of change and nurture a sustainable tomorrow. Before we part ways, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Join us in the quest for a greener, brighter future. Together, we can make a difference.